welcome to Ditsy's Diamond Den. So today we are going to be unboxing a square by JoJo's Art called Spring Bringers. We did buy this from Diamond Art Club and this one is kind of big. It is a 93 by 70 centimeters. I did buy this on my Black Friday for Dear Helper. Mm -hmm. He kept saying, get this one, get this one. And I'm like, eh. he's like, come on, get it. So, the question is now, do I do it for him or do I put it on his list of ones to do? I can probably do it. It might take him some time. It does take him some time, but we'll see. So, this guy is big. I am going to pull this out. Did you hear that thump? <laughs> That's how heavy this is. It was like thump. I am going to hand off these drills. For my sound sensitive viewers, I'm going to show you them. Oh my goodness. I see some really pretty green ones. Look at that. It's oh, it's all those lot. drills. That's a lot of drills. <laughs> it's heavy. So inside we are going to find our thank you from Diamond Art Club with tips, tricks, video stuff, social media, um, all their app stuff. We do get this adorable little sticker with all of the information on it. We also, of course, get our toolkit, which always comes with fun stuff inside of it. If you have been liking my channel, do please like and subscribe. We do all different kinds of things from kit ups to kit downs, unboxings, whipping chats, and <clears throat> <gasps> giveaways so we do have a see proof that this yeah blue and that is a pretty blue which is one of dear helpers favorite colors of blue superman because he's a superman in case you guys have not noticed yes i married superman oh okay new cover minder matches my nails I am in love. Look at this little strawberry. <gasps> okay, I need to get a strawberry shortcake canvas now, just so I can use this on it. We have our Ziploc bags. We have our four and our seven placers. We have our washi tape. I have had that one before. It's a little psychedelic. We have our tray and stopper and our heart wax that does come with a cover on top of the heart wax. Make sure you're peeling that back to get inside of it. And it is a square, so it does come with the tweezers that are very, very sharp. Don't go stabbing anybody with these. Although you could keep these by your front door and use these instead of like a bat in case somebody tries to break in. Yeah, <laughs> maybe not. You can just come at them and be like, murder tweezers, who needs a bat? Oh my goodness, did you see the cover render I got? Oh, that's cool. No strawberry shortcake strawberry. Right? That's what I said. Oh. Yeah. Alright. So, here is our sticker sheet. It's got all of the pertinent information on it also. So pretty. Those eyes. Oh, I think I know something. So this side is a sticker sheet. You can put this um, inside of your logbook. And over here are also stickers that go on your containers. We do have a couple different special drills in here. So we have two ABs, which stand for Aurora Borealis. It is a drill that has a coating over the top of it that makes it shimmer and sparkle like the rainbow, very glittery. I will stop and point those out when I get to them. At the bottom, you're gonna see some numbers that have letters in front of them. So these are Diamond Art Club's special drills. So anything that starts with a Z, we have three of those are going to be fairy dust, which basically look like a glitter bomb, but glitter does not rub off. And we have L563. So whenever you see an L in front of the numbers, that is going to be an iridescent. And they're like, so the, you have the bottom of the drill and it looks like they colored the inside of it. And then they put like a clear crystal on top, almost like a diamond ring, like a colored diamond ring. They are gorgeous. I love the iridescence. So let's get this rolled backwards. 
And this one's gonna be a little awkward to show you guys because it is a right to left canvas, not an up and down canvas. So, okay, keep on rolling. <laughs> Keep on rolling. I like that. Got some fuzzy fuzzes. I love the scalloped edges that you get on the Diamond Art Club. They're so pretty. I think I spun that out enough. Okay, so let's go this way. Uh, we're gonna have to kind of go up and I'm gonna take a picture for you guys, okay? Um, that way, <laughs> awesome. Okay, let's start from the top and kind of go outwards. This is awkward. I'm being awkward, guys. Oh my goodness, look at those cherry blossoms. That is Deer Helper's favorite smell. When he does get a sniff of cherry blossoms, he's always like, what is that smell? It's so good. Here's the bottom half. Okay, does this make you think of wow at all? It does kind of look a little bit of World like, of Warcraft. Yeah, like the some like, of the sections. When you're there. playing World of Warcraft and you um, turn into a stag on the druid. Oh, it does. Very I much bet so. that's why you fell yeah, in probably, love with this. It's got, it's got the, the little design, the yeah, glowing the designs on there. I bet that's why you were like, oh, Maybe oh, pretty, up. almost. Okay. So once you open this up and actually take a look, yeah, that stag looks very World of Warcraft if you are a fan of World of Warcraft. I'm not going to lie, I kind of stopped playing it when Blizzard went through all their stuff a couple years ago and had that bad press. So 63 colors. Let's take a look at them. I think you made the right decision. Yeah, I like this. Good job on you for being bossy. Mm -hmm. Should do that more often. Okay, so I'm gonna show all these drills. Your helper's gonna take a look at this and tell us what his favorite parts are. Cause he's the one that wanted it. Let him talk for a little bit. I like that it's like they said they call it the spring bringer. So behind the stag, you've got all the animals coming to life. The green coming out in front of it is still, um, you know, showing the winter time. Um, I, I really like that. I like the look of the stag. I love the blossoms coming off of his antlers and just everything about it. I, I like all the color to it. Ooh, we got three bags of the 3750. Nice. And here's our first special drill. We do have a pink fairy dust, and we can already tell where those are going to go, right? Yep. yep. Gorgeous. So look at those glitter bombs. Boom. All right. We have two bags of the 930, two bags of the 931, and here is our next fairy dust. That is a gorgeous, oh, okay. Is this one? Yeah, this is our first like dark green of the fairy dust, and that is, wow. Yeah, I like that. Isn't that so grass colored? And goodness knows you love your lawn. Yes, I do. What do you think of the icicles that are coming off that tree? I like that. Now, like I said, I like everything about this one. I like that there's no, it doesn't look like there's any type of massive color blocking that you're going to have to do. Because I do single place. Of the 3768. You single place with what? Tweezers. Of course. I, I, I tried to single place with the, uh, uh, whatever you call it. With the pins? Yep, with the pin. I just can't do it. Yeah, which kind of sucks because we were on the auction, two bags of the 954, two bags of the 3865 from Bistro Blanks, two bags of 898, and I saw a bluey pen that they made, and I wish that he used pens, two bags of 932, because he loves bluey. I do, I like blue, I don't know why, it's just... Uh... It's funny. It's just funny. All right, so we have some Z159, which is also a fairy dust. Gorgeous. So when I saw that bluey pen, I was like, oh my goodness, I want to get this for you so bad. 
but he doesn't use them and they are a little spendy and I just couldn't see spending quite that much on something he would never use. Nope, I just wouldn't. I just like tweezers. Look at those. Those are cool looking. Okay. That was a lot. I want to know where these are going to go. These are the iridescents. I'm going to flip these over and we're going to get a good look at those. It's yeah, I'm going to make sure you get a good look. Aren't those gorgeous? Those are pretty pretty darn cool. These are going to create an amazing glow effect. Yeah, I can't now, wait to see where they go. Oh though. my goodness, if only they could do like a glow in, do glow in the dark iridescent. That'd be, that'd be <gasps> All right, I need to email them at Art Club. We need a glow in the dark iridescent. Could you imagine how cool that would be for Halloween too? For anything, really. Okay, I love it. Two bags of the three three six, and two bags of the eight thirty nine. Two bags of the nine thirty eight. Those are very close together. Gotta be careful with those. This has got some amazing greens in it. Ooh, hot pink. All right. That is it. Wait. Oh, no, nope. one more train. I have another train. Sometimes I just get lost. We got some special drills in this train also, so we definitely don't want to miss that. Look at that forest green. Yeah. You remember we were in our 20s and we loved forest green and we painted like everything in our house forest green and we look at pictures now we're like what were we thinking yeah i don't know what we were thinking i don't know what we were thinking kids huh here is the 105 this ad is very pretty i have used it before there we go this comes out gorgeous i'm very excited to see where that is going to be what kind of uh do you guys ever look back at some of your houses you had when you were like 18 or 19 compared to like how you decorate now and you're just like, um, oops. It's like looking back at photos, 131. From your hairstyles when you were a teenager. That is gorgeous. Ooh, that's like a golden rod. I like that one. So far, what's been your favorite color that we've looked through? Uh, the iridescent. The iridescent? Of course. Uh, with an army green. Okay. No more surprise train. Figure out where... Okay, I'm not going to point out every special drill because this thing's kind of big. But I'm definitely going to try to point out as much as we can. And this is your baby. Do you want to start with the ABs or do you want to start with the specials? Uh, let's get the ABs. There's only two of those and I'm very curious because I haven't looked at it too closely to see where those iridescents go. So let's start with the uh, ABs first. All right. So we have the number one, which is the 105, which is that brownish AB. And that is going to be back here, kind of highlighting uh, your druid's bottom. I'm calling this thing a druid. The, even the top of them. Yep. All up to the top there. And we uh, also have some over here in the owl. And there's owl. some in the owl. And in the, what are those, sparrows? I couldn't, I couldn't tell, but we're going to just call them birds. Birds. In the birds. But we got different Bird. kinds of birds. And we also have some over here in the rabbit ears. Yep. And a little bit on the snake. Oh, and we also have some on the hawk. And then we have our number two that is going to be right through here. We have got some, oh, look, here's a little brown like moth with some ABs in it oh, also. Yeah. So we got some cute little daffodils or marigolds, one of those that are going to have some of those yellow ABs in it. We got some butterflies. Oh, here's some more moths. Oh, look, there's a dragonfly. Oh, yeah, there is. There's another butterfly with the twos in it. Mm -hmm. And then there's some more butterflies up here. With some twos. I don't think these ones are butterflies. They look almost like, maybe they are butterflies. No, they they are look butterflies. like leaves. There's butterflies up through here. No, I, I'm oh, pretty okay. positive those are butterflies. All right. So we do have the pink fairy dust, and we're going to have that down here. Be kind. We can see it. So we're going to have some of that down here in these flowers. And, of course, we're going to have a little bit of that in our pink butterflies which are also scattered out here to the right. And 
Tons of it. Boom! In the antlers. In the cherry blossoms. Just everywhere. All over it. It Indeed. looks awesome. So pretty. And then we have our green fairy dust, which looks like, of course, the grass. And what do you know? Here's some in the grass. Yeah, just spread out right yeah. through here. Spread out. Oh, we got some in the trees. It looks like it's highlighting the tops of the outsides of all of the trees. Yeah. Yep, it is just everywhere, all along it. It is. Are you seeing anywhere? Over there, I think it's just all nope. on the so it's just all on the right side of the canvas in the greenery. We have that gray, which is the Z159. I can't tell if it was a really light blay. I think it's like a bluish gray color. Yep, I see that. So kind of down here. Yep, that is going to be over here, kind of. So we're going to have the green fairy dust um, for the grass. And then we're going to move a little bit in here through the middle. And then as we get over to the left side, we're going to have some of that gray fairy dust as the snow caps. It kind of comes up through here also into the tree. And up in the icicles, it looks like we have some of that as well through here. Oh. All through the icicles. That's going to be pretty. All right. And then, of course, we have those gorgeous iridescence. And I can see it now, right here. All of the green on the stag itself is those iridescence. Mm -hmm. Yep. We also have some because you can see that the magic. This hey, is bringing the this spring. This is representing the magic. So we're going to have these iridescence all it. throughout his magic sploof. Sploof? I I don't know. Sploof. His magic sploof out this way. And then here's the part. I don't know if you notice this. Hmm. Look at all the animal's eyes. Oh, all the animal's eyes are those those iridescents. So they all glow. That's so awesome. let's get down here in this little area and let's zoom in and kind of show. So it's just one, but every single of the sparrows, the owls, all of them have these iridescent eyes. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> that is going to be awesome. You did good, babe. I did. This is a good one. I like it a lot. What do you guys think? You think you did good? I did good. Yeah. And this this is going to be fun, too. It's going to be a fun one to do. Well, thanks for joining us. If you're liking the content we're putting out, uh, like and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Bye. So today we are going to be unboxing my Cyber Monday that I was so very excited about by Hannah Lynn Star Chasers. She is a 45.1 by 62.7 centimeter square. And I am just, oh my goodness. This unicorn, everything about this one super excited me. I am just dig into this. I apologize if I just talk way too fast. That happens to me when I get ridiculously excited. This is the straightest little sticker I think I've ever gotten. There's no curvature to that. Oh, wow. So here is our little sticker that has all of the information on that. Um, I am going to hand off this bag of drills over to Dear Helper because I know that some people are sound sensitive. And I do try to respect that as much as I can. Opening these can, of course, sometimes just get a little loud, especially when I'm going through the drills. So here is all of the colors. Look at that beautiful mixture of light and darks. That looks fun. I love the mixture of them. So let's get into our toolkit over here. You don't have to rip that off. If you like everything to be nice and neat, it drives your helper a little bit nuts when I rip things. He's like, you don't have to rip that. <laughs> I just, I don't know. I like ripping it. So we have a very happy pink pen. And we have our four and our seven placers. We have our Ziploc bags. We have our tray with our tray stopper. We have our heart wax. Make sure you take the top off to get to that wax. We have, I don't know if I have this particular rose. 
We have a light uh, greenish rose. I think probably Dear Helper will want to put that one over on his magnet oh, yeah, side. Nice. And we have our washi tape over here. Pretty. Does not go with this painting, but it is pretty. I apologize. My parents were butt dialing me earlier, so that's probably them saying, oops, sorry. And then, of course, we have murder tweezers. Very, very sharp. They can draw blood. And not a little bit of blood. They can, like, really draw some blood. Those only do come in the squares. We have our thank you for your purchase, app information, tips and tricks, how to diamond paint video, and step-by-step -step instructions. We have our sticker sheet. This half can be cut out and put into your logbook. And then over here, we have 56 beautiful colors. These are also stickers that you can take off and put onto your drill holders. So for Diamond Art Club, anything 149 and under is going to be an AB. So this does come with four ABs. If you're new to diamond painting, an AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It is a uh, coating on top of it that shimmers in like the rainbow, like the Aurora Borealis, and it's super, super bright. All other drills are very nice and shiny, but these ones just light up the whole area. We do also have one special drill. You will find these at the end, and they will have a letter affixed to the front of them. i sorry about my dog. He's very old. Um, he can't help himself. And so this is a Z, so that is going to be a fairy dust drill, which basically just looks like it was made out of a glitter bomb, but don't worry, you're not going to get glitter all over yourself. Um, and so that is going to be Z600. That looks very, very pretty. Let's roll this backwards and take a look. I am so excited to actually see this because you see them in the small pictures and it never does them justice. I'm telling you, these are softer, babe. I know you say they're not, but they feel softer to me. So you see them in the small pictures, of course, when you're buying them on the internet. But it does not do, those little pictures do not do them justice. And then even after you buy it and you look at the canvas before you've put the drills on it, that does not even do it justice. It is not until you've actually placed all of the drills you are going to see all the little tiny details that are inside of it that will just amaze you. And that for me is a lot of the fun is seeing those little details that I miss come to life. Oh, that unicorn looks wild and free. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, she is just knocking my socks off. She is knocking my Eevee socks off. Look at that hair. That is just pastel heaven. Oh, okay. And I don't know if you guys can notice this. So her hoofs are very furry. It's like she's got like socks on her uh, legs that go into her hoofs, which is just awesome. And of course, she is a Pegasus. Um, sorry, she's not a unicorn, she is a Pegasus. She's got her wings over here. This is so my little pony drills. So let's go ahead and get into these drills. I will stop at the special drills so we can show them off and amaze you. Wow. I don't know what I am more excited about. The hoofs, the things, that her hair, I don't know, crazy. There are so many different um, fun things about this. So we've got two, four, six, eight, eight, three tens. So just so you know, Hannah Lynn's always comes with a lot of three tens. 
and that is because she does her art like a drawing and so she does actually have everything all these small parts are going to be covered in the three tens to just add more uh, texture and cartoony character we have two bags of the 3799 i am always a fan of the grays so I do not buy all of the Hannah ones. I definitely am a big fan of hers, but I do only buy pieces that something about it really, really speaks to me. So I've got a couple of them, and every time I do one, I am always just amazed. It, that one becomes my new favorite Hannah one. <laughs> So that is one of the things that I do like about her is every time there's our first AB, that is a light blue. Let's get in there and take a look. See that shimmer that I'm talking about? That is gonna just light up all the areas around our canvas where that is placed. It has a beautiful effect. Here is another 141. I am getting quite the collection of 141 ABs here. But that is okay because they are gorgeous. Yeah, so one of the things I just, I absolutely, every time I do one, it is my new favorite Canelon ever. And I do only buy, of course, something that speaks to either me or Dear Helper. And there is a green AB. Kind of looks like a pea green. We're getting a little exorcist in here with this. Pea soup. And this is just, oh, some of these. There's a 129 AB. I am loving the dreams in these. We go from really dark to pastel to muted. I think that is going to, oh, 498. That is a gorgeous red. One of the things that I love about doing these diamond paintings is even when I don't like a color, I feel like there are no ugly colors when it comes to to drill. At least I have not found one to where I'm just like, oh, uh, that's not very pretty. I don't like that one. Pretty. Some of these colors are just amazing. Ha, huh, orange. So little oranges. All right, we are on our very last one. And here is our fairy dust, and that is, ooh, that one's a hot pink. So Z600, we got some hot pink fairy dust. So we'll zoom in on there, and you can see like that glitter bomb effect. I don't know if you can. So here is the tops of one of those. You can see the glitter, and then compare it to like, to like that, the tops. So you can just see it's got more shimmer and shine to it. So we got the 162, the 604, and the 3811, which is actually one of my favorite blues to work with. It is just gorgeous. So let's figure out where all of these amazing special drills are going to be going. I do want to point out that this is, Diamond Art Club does pay their artists. That is really important. This is copyright Hannah Lynn. If you are purchasing diamond paintings and you are able to afford something that, where the artist is getting paid for, I strongly encourage you to do it because, well, when you buy diamond paintings that are not copyrighted, they're not getting paid and they deserve their paychecks. We've got our Facebook stuff and of course our beautiful lifetime warranty that DAC offers. It does have the 56 colors and what, do, I think I'm gonna start with the fairy dust because I am digging that hot pink fairy dust. So it's gonna be right here on her sash. I think this is gonna be her leg and if that is her leg with a striped stocking, I'm gonna love it. 
So we've got her sash. We've got a couple dots. We have a couple more dots on her um, top that she is wearing. And that is definitely... Here we go. We have some fairy dust in her hair. We have some fairy dust up here. And please have some fairy dust in the Pegasus. Please, please, please. And the wings looks like. <gasps> yes. Okay. So we have some fairy dust in right the, the Pegasus's wings and around the eye right through here. Thank you, dear helper. You're welcome. We have our white AB, which is going to be in her stockings. And as always, generally when you get white ABs, they are sprinkled throughout in little one and four packs. We've got a lot of it up here in her top hair. And we have some in the unicorn's eyes. And then kind of sprinkled throughout just onesies and twosies. We have that very pretty yellow color, which is going to be the 129. And that is our number three. We're going to have some of that coming throughout her hair in that section and that's it so we just have some of that uh, butter yellow in her hair we have the 120 which is that blue AB that is also going to be in her hair there's also some up here in this corner edge there's also some in the Pegasus's mane We've got some coming over here in this area, and we, oh no, we do have a little bit here in her skirt at the bottom. So our number 100, which was that lime, well, pea green, pea green, pea green, pea green um, AB, that is going to be in the Pegasus's eyeball going to be very, very pretty. And we also have a little section right through here in her hair. And that is going to be it for that particular one. I am very excited to be doing this. Um, if you have been liking my content, please do like and subscribe. We do appreciate everybody that has been watching our videos and we look forward to putting out our next one. Thanks. Bye.